we went to Paris for my husband's birthday at the end of August and I kind of got caught up. I really did. Um, you know, they say Paris is the fashion capital and I was shopping. I, I, I really was. It was his birthday, but I took advantage of the trip and um, I did some shopping. So I do have a few unboxings for you today. Um, one of them, I'm gonna give you the story about that when I get to it, but we're gonna start with this one first. Uh, the beautiful Chanel. All right, let's see what we have in here. And I had to buy another suitcase to get stuff back home because my suitcase was already packed to the brim and it was overweight. Luckily, I got reimbursed for the overweight charges, but here we go. Let's open her up. I will say that um, the experience shopping at Chanel and Paris was amazing. I had a phenomenal SA and I forget her name, but she was super sweet. I'm going to insert a video of her um, actually bringing everything to me. Let's see what we got. So this is a dust bag, some care tips, just some care tips. Let's see what else. And this item I had been looking for for some time. So this was actually on my wish list. I guess all the items were on my wish list. So this one I tried to pick up in London. I was at Harrods and the service at Harrods was just not the best. So I didn't get to pick it up there. But when I saw it in Paris in the store, I couldn't leave it behind. Um, and everybody was talking about the VAT refund. Um, I think it's like a 12% refund that you can get at the airport. But our dollar is weak in Europe right now. So I don't even know if I really saved any money. According to my husband, I didn't. Maybe $50. But guys, are you ready for the smoke? Ooh, the vanity. Oh my God. I have been dreaming of her. She is gorgeous. You can see the gold. Well, no, the silver. I'm lying. Silver hardware is the light. So you can see the silver Chanel here and then the zip. And then you see the hardware on the top handles. My... Um, where is this? It's going to be a purse. It is not going to be for a vanity. Okay. I'm not doing it. It's going to be a cute little purse. So I'm going to open her up for you. Oh, and now I'm going to use to the bottom too, because how stinking cute is that? How cute is that? You have the embossed Chanel logo bit under the, the bag. All right. So if you open her up, she is a burgundy color inside, and I'm going to pull this out, which is, appears to be a mirror. It is a mirror. How cute is that? And then you have the little pouch that the mirror kind of sits into, so I'm going to put it back in there. And then right here you do have the Chanel, and it says Made in Italy. I don't know if you can see that or not. All right. And then I'm going to take this out. And then inside of the, you can see there's a little pocket here. And there's a little pocket here. And honestly, the way it is quilted, it kind of gave me old lady vibes. <laughs> but I still love it. Like, I can put, you know my stuff in here my wallet and all that stuff and I'm good what do you think about this cutie I love her but I will throw up the measurements up there for you as well if I can find those um, on this I do have another item as well another Chanel -y. All right, let's open her up. I will not, just FYI, I'm not buying anything for a long time. So for now, I'll probably 
for a couple months. I'll just maybe show you what I have in my collection, what fits in my bag or something like this because I did too much. I really did. I did too much. <clears throat> so here's this item. It does come in this black pouch with the black Chanel on the, the case. And then you have your care card back here. And let's open her up. Check her out. I have the wallet. Oh my gosh, she's so adorable. Oh, I cannot wait to wear her. So it has the same graining as my Chanel bag. Shit, they're twinsies. Anyway, back to her. We're going to open her up. So. You do have a back pocket here where you can slide maybe some money or a card in there. And then on the front side, you do have your Chanel logo here. And then by the way, the hardware is silver. It is a silver hardware. And I actually tried to get this while I was in Beverly Hills as well for my birthday. And they did not have them. Sadly, I got something else for my birthday. I'm going to have to do a separate unboxing because I did not bring it up with me. So, um... And then it's like a slot here and then you have an opening here and then yeah that's pretty much it but the quality feels good she's beautiful um in terms of wear again i don't know i have to wear her and see how she do over time but yep this is this one and then let's see what else we have Oh my god, this is a lot. Um Bankly. This was actually the first purchase that I made while I was in Paris. Um my essay was Lynn at the um the store. He was phenomenal. Um, I did have a hiccup because when I went, I did not have my passport with me. So I had to come back the next day for um, the VAT refund. And I feel like, I don't know, it was, it was a weird vibe. They would not let me speak to him. They took me over to another building and um, they gave me my VAT. So I had to come back again to pick it up. And when I went back to pick it up, they gave me a bag and this with my bracelet. In it. That's it. They didn't give me the box. They didn't wrap it. This is all I got. And when I went back to him, because I had to go get my certificate and authenticity, authenticity, he gave me everything that I was supposed to have. Like, mm, that was a little sus. But other than that, it was good working with Lynn. Um, so we're going to open her right on up. You can see the box. It does say Van Cleef, Art Bells. And then it comes in this green box. Which one do you think I have? Before I open it, go ahead and leave a comment of which one you think I have. And then, here we go. Ah, I got the Onyx. She is a beautiful. And I think I have, I insert like a little video when we were actually in the store shopping for it. I may have tried it on, or I think I had my sister-in-law try it on, so... I can see how it looked on her but I had a couple colors to choose from and this one right here was the one I selected y'all and they did have to take some links out because it was too big they said that also too the color selection is limited because the guys are wearing the bracelets as well but I think they had to take out six links for it to fit my wrist um, so I will definitely try to insert that video so you can see but She's stunning. Absolutely beautiful. Um, I would highly recommend. My husband, like, when I initially showed him this, because I asked for it last Christmas, he was like, no, it's not worth it. But when he sent it in the store, he felt differently. So he was kind of on my side on that. He thought it was pretty cool. Um, but this is what came with it. Like I said, this is what they sent me out of the store with um, initially can't believe it i was horrified about that but that's what's that um i don't know 
we're almost done for it. And then it also came with this as well. And it's a brush and like a cleaning cloth. So you got the little brush there and then you have a cleaning cloth. And then a booklet as well. All right. And then my card of authenticity is somewhere around here. Uh, but the final thing I purchased was this. So my previous video, if you want to go back and watch it, it was a continuation of, of that purchase. Um, so let's dig in to see what I have. I'm going to start here. These are some samples of some perfume. It's two of those. I don't know if you can see those, but super cute with a little bow. Love that. Um, oh, she gave me plenty actually. And I usually give these away, but I might keep them. Second thing is cleaning cloth and some solution, some cleaning solution. Let me see that. And then you have your booklet back here as well. And your certificate of authenticity. I'm going to open her up. She is unopened. Just letting you know. She's legit. All right, and let's get to it. Let's, without, uh-oh, wait a minute. There's something else in here. All right, so I have this little pouch, and I guess you could just put the item in here, and it has like a little pillow that it could go on with some pockets. It has two pockets in here, too. I don't know if you can see that, but it has two back pockets. I gotta find my card for my and here it goes without further ado let's open her up ah, pop her back and as you can see she's in the iconic box are you ready are you ready for this I did get the love bracelet bangle. I did not get, oh, and you can see the card again. I did not want the bracelet. I just didn't want to deal with keeping it on all the time because I like switching out my jewelry. But here it goes. She's super cute. And I'm going to show you how I put it on. And <clears throat> there was one other size that was a little bit smaller. But here it, on, here it is. I feel pretty comfortable that she won't leave me. Because <laughs> the other one I could not even get on my wrist. And it kind of reminds me of my Tiffany bracelet bangle. Now, full disclosure, I did lose this one time. And I was like, I'm not going to get it back. But it was at the store and I called and somebody turned it in. I was very nice of them. I probably didn't know what kind of bracelet it was. But um, but this one, this bangle, I love, love, love. And I hadn't seen many people with the bangle. And I guess over time, I will let you guys know how I feel about it. It doesn't really move but yeah love her so um if you have any questions about any of the items that i purchased on my trip to paris for my husband's birthday and i just went crazy um just let me know i will do some update videos on how the items hold up um if they're durable um how i like them later on but as of right now, I think my wish list of items is actually com um, complete. I think my heart is content. And then in the inside, it does have Cartier. And 
I'm assuming that's like a um, serial number. Let's see if I can let you guys see inside. If you can see that. But yes, um, that concludes my unboxing. I hope you guys liked it. If you have not already, make sure you like and subscribe. Thank you so much for stopping by. It is a longer video. I did have a lot of items to open. But yeah, stay tuned. Um, I do have another unboxing coming soon. All right, guys. Bye.